So while we've got a little time, tell me more about yourself, Bobby. What was life like before we met? Huh. I'm not sure where to start. You know that saying, life hits you hard? Well, I got hit super hard. Getting smacked around by life? Oof. Sounds intense, but I think I know that feeling. Oh, right. Your brother really made a mess of things, so I guess we're in the same boat. Literally. You've got that right, but I'm going to keep doing my best. Let's get to the next streamer and stop my brother. Here we are. Sweet Paper Valley. This is the last down river stop. Thanks for riding with us today and enjoy your stay. Wow, look at these rocks. You couldn't build a place like this if you tried. I've heard of a valley fold, but this is like an actual valley. All right, let's hurry through Sweet Paper Valley and find that streamer. Right on. Hello everyone, and welcome back. I know it's a bit late for me to be making that intro, but I didn't want to talk too early during that moment. Welcome back to Paper Mario the Origami King. So last time we went to into the Shogun Studios Theater, and we took out Rubber Band. And let me tell you, he definitely knows how to put on a stage play, but... Unfortunately for him, his fame was not meant to last. So here we are in Sweet Paper Valley. The area that I have not fully explored before or seen explored. Bobby also got his memories back, which is a plus. We origami folk have a saying. For every mountain fold, there is a valley fold. It's probably about the ups and downs of life. Or it could be about actual folding, I guess. Hard to say. Either way, that's pretty deep. And inspiring. Even a dud like me might climb up one of life's mountains someday. Maybe we all might do that at some point. I've been up, I've been up plenty of 14ers in, in my time when I was in Colorado. And for those who don't know what 14er means, um, it basically means, um, 14er basically is a 14,000 foot high mount. Or, not, yeah, I think 14,000 feet high. That streamer just keeps going through the valley and beyond. Looks like we'll all need to go through that tunnel to reach the other side. Hey! Wait. This is- wait. Really? This is a valley? It seems rather small, but okay. Alright, I guess there's- is there anything else here? No. No, that's it. Oh, hello. <gasps> it's King Ollie! Ollie! Yes, it's been a while, hasn't it? Oh, you've stolen Peach's castle, wrapped it in streamers, crumpled up countless toads. Why must you keep doing this? It's so mean! Ah, sister. You have such a flat outlook on life. All I am doing is creating a glorious kingdom for origami like us. How can you not grasp the brilliance and daring of my plan? A world for origami? But origami and flat paper can live together. You don't need to be so mean to these nice paper folks. It's just not right. You've got to stop right now. Very well. I thought perhaps you would listen to reason. I see I was mistaken. Ever since you teamed up with this Mario fellow, you've been nothing but a crinkle in my neck. It ends now. Oh! 
Olivia? Dude! Consider this path closed. Alas, there will be an empty origami throne beside... Dude, that line is chilling. I'm going to, uh... Oh my god. Okay, even if I were, even if I knew this was coming, the shock is still there. The the dialogue that built up to it just makes it still just as shocking. Ugh, the stupid boulder won't budge. There has to be something we can do. Ma'am? Ma'am, are you okay under there? She's okay, but it, it, it can't be good to flatten origami like that. If we don't do something soon, soon she might be permanently crumpled. Sneeze. <coughs> what can we do? Even, we, we can't use a thousand-fold arms, because if we need Olivia to do that... Bobby, what are you thinking? Yes. It's the only way. I know how to save Olivia, Big M. We have to... Set sail! We have to get to the port in Toad Town and set sail for the Great Sea. I know it seems crazy to leave Olivia here, but... I need you to trust me, Big M. I trust you, Bobby. Don't worry, Olivia. We're gonna get you out of there. Little... help? The music picked up after that incident with Ollie. Like, dude, how can you do that to your own sister? God damn. He really did not. Ahoy! Was there an earthquake? I thought I heard something big. Anyhow, if you're looking to get to Toad Town, the, the warp pipe in Shogun Studios is way faster than paddling. So what'll it be? Poor Olivia. Beautiful music. Alright, Big M, should we head straight for the port? Yes. First off, let's talk to you. We must hurry. For, for with every passing second, Olivia is slowly being crushed more and more.
Thanks for taking me all the way out here to the Great Sea, Big M. I've got a plan to rescue Olivia, but we'll need a special item first. It'll be found on the luxury ship, uh, the Princess Peach. It should still be out here. Somewhere. I hope. Once we get our hands on that item, we can save Olivia in no time. So, remember before how I said um, Bobby didn't really comment on any other parts outside of, um, you know, Shogun Studios and all that? I guess he was going to, but we weren't supposed to come here yet, so... go ahead and get this item that Bobby needs. The secret to saving Olivia is on that bit is on that ship, Big M. We'll find it in the VIP stateroom on the second level. There's an elevator right inside the main hall. Let's head there first. Hey, we can get in there now. We've already been here before, so we just need to head right in. Whoa. This looks even worse than I remembered. You're probably wondering why the ship is all banged up. Long story. I'll explain later, okay? Let's hop in that elevator and hurry to the VIP stateroom. I have a bad feeling about this place. It's kind, it's kind of eerie. Oh, there is a toad in here. Oh god. Ah! Dude, come on. You can't scream like that. It scared me half to death. I think this toad is a member of the crew here. Let's uh let him, let him rest. Oh, poor guy. A lot of the a lot of these toads are probably going to be rather traumatized. <gasps> Dude, they're hiding. Oh my god. You can't fucking scare me like that! God damn! <laughs> that would have gotten me real good if that were me. Where are you going, Big M? The elevator to the VIP stateroom is the other way. I know, I'm just looking around. Peachy Keen Lounge. Wow, this room got hit pretty bad. This was such a cool lounge before. You could see the entire ocean out the window. Out that window. Is that what I think it is? Can I actually get up here this way? No, that lamp is in the way. <gasps> okay, I get I should have known I wasn't strong enough to take them out in one hit. Line them up.
These guys are tough. Ow! You motherfucker. You got shiny mushroom. That'll do. We're still on wave one, too. Let's try a hurl hammer. <sighs> Beautiful. So that's like for the perfect lineup. Cool! 800 coins for that! God, that... <laughs> they, they really know how to get the jump on you. Ah! Something pounded on the main window. Something big! It was so scary! Well, now something else is going to be pounding on the main window, and it's going to be me. Where are you going, Big M? The elevator to the VIP stateroom is the other way. I know, but... I just felt like I had to come this way. Ah! I thought I... You really can never tell if it's a shy guy or a sniffet. And it's scary. That'll do. Ah! 
I like doing that. Wheelhouse. Engine room. What's in the engine room? Yeah. How the fuck? You stopped, like, less than a foot in front of me. I really want to become strong enough to just take you out in one hit. I'd like to see your... I'd like to see your furniture. Oh, we even watch fun. that thing. So t terrifying. 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 I tell you, a lot of these toads are poor and traumatized. Not even the vi not even the vault in Princess Peach's castle is going to pay all the bills for their therapy. What have I said? Whoa! Is this heaven? Yes, 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 I know. The elevator to the VIP stateroom's the other way. I'm just looking around because I like exploring places. Where am I now? Hey, look! It's Mario in a pipe! <laughs> <laughs> Mario funny. In a pipe, more like Mario and a bitch. No, I'm kidding. Oh. Dave, do I want a crafting table or a knife? Obviously, a crafting table. <gasps> Is that a submarine? Oh no, wait, it's an engine. Make a fridge. Fudge. Huh. This seems a bit yeah. fishy. Looks like someone made this hole on purpose. Hold up. Do you think that means? <gasps> Do I, should I get the crafting table or save up for the fridge? Put up your folded paper dukes. We're gonna crumple you like yesterday's homework. Go get him, Big M. Uh, Me no like spider. Refrigerate you, baby. That's gonna kill him, Tippy. Murderer. Hides knife behind back. What are you talking about? <laughs> this intervention. <laughs> Go to Drago. So something else I noticed: uh, whenever you're fighting a certain enemy that you have to fight a certain way, some of the toads in the background will collectively say, "Hey, you should uh, you should use this specific item to fight him effectively." Excellent! What? Yeah, or I could do this. The best way to kill spiders is with fire. Feel the burn! Pop, pop, pop. I see what you're saying, Dave, but also, uh, the, I need 150 stone. 
if I want to get that fridge. Can I break the rock with the light bulb balls? No, I can't. Oh yeah, I forgot this was a weight battle. Can I like hit the rock, please? There we go. What the hell am I supposed to? The fuck? I see another gray rock. Oh wait, duh. Die, Spooters, die. Hmm? Yeah, rub it in my face. <laughs> Fair, but... Great lineup, attack power up! Boink, 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 dude. Poof. What's this? There's an opening. Sometimes you concern me. Yeah. I know you're joking. Wheelhouse. What the fuck? Oh, it's just another crew member. Little guy snuck up on me. This one's unconscious. These toads must have had quite a shock. Take a map. Free map.
Big M, help! I'm a bob bomb, not a bonbon! Bon. <laughs> Heaven Vord. I said Heaven Vord. I like how you're like, pardon? <laughs> did I hear that? Did I hear you not up the shut fuck? Where did. Where did those spikes even come from when a spike pulls them out? So useless. <laughs> he tries though, he tries. <laughs> I guess, yeah. I mean, what else can he do? The guy doesn't have a fuse. True. Dave. I wonder which one I should flip. Maybe Flapjack. Yeah, I'm so funny. You know what? Close enough. You know what would really suck about this battle system? What? If you couldn't go past one tile- Nice one, Bobby. If you couldn't go past one tile to actually jump on the enemy, and they all had to be within range of one jump. Yeah. Finish them. Now, finish you! I just realized I didn't pause the game, and now it's 1.54 p.m. 1.30 a.m. I got a superstar! It's canon, that's what they're called. They're, they're canonically called superstars now. What? You can't do this to me, Lucy. She... Hang on. I fucking know it. I used to dream of being a ship captain. Ooh, or an admiral. I bet I'd be a pretty cool admiral. Is that a callback to fucking Thousand Year Door when we had to find General White? Then wh who was the one? Oh wait, yeah, yeah. Well then, what about Captain Bobbery? It's gotta be a callback to something. Sells my extra hammer. Well, now that we found a lever, now we can go back down into the engine room. Can you only get seeds from plants by using the sickle on them when they're fully grown? Um, Zippy? Yeah? Bobby's, uh... He's, um... Ah, uh, fusion is just a cheap tactic to make weak gems <laughs> stronger. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm not sure how I feel about this. There we go. I've taken multiple photos of this. <laughs> Yeah, right next to me. Besides what? the... What? Right next to me is a certain small horse. Actually, two small horses and a deer. Oh, yeah. It's and Horso little, and Deero. And a little green one. Yeah. Bobby, I get it. This is not the direction to the VIP room. You can stop reminding me every time I go into a room. Bobby says, go to the VIP room. Or, Where are you going, Big M? The VIP room is the other way. Bobby says, go to the VIP room or face the dock of shame. 
The dock of shame is walked of- uh, The dock of shame is sent to the dock of shame. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that lever is a perfect fit. That's what she said. The well, system does not have time to differentiate between good and bad note passing. Now, go to the gates of shame. Yay! I did it! Oh hey, the power's back. Good thing we stopped in here. The elevator probably wouldn't have worked before. Yeah, it's almost like I didn't want to go the other way. Me want me want go up there for con for colorful bag. Let me up there. Let me the fuck up there. Why why do these stairs have to be collapsed? You know your confetti is pretty much full already, right? There, it's more than just it's. <gasps> I guess I'm part bat pony. It can't be. We might be in real trouble here, Big M. We have to hurry to- ENOUGH ABOUT THE f FUCKING STATE ROOM. I get it. I need to get whatever item you need. But can I keep myself alive first? There's a toad down there and I have no idea how the- how the fuck to get down there. Just had a cursed day I thought. Oh. That's how I get down here. What? My, uh, my cursed day I thought is freaking Mario, but it has parkour mechanics. Which means what? <laughs> it means like you can jump and grab onto a ledge if you don't quite make the jump and shit like that. Um, I'm, pr I'm pretty sure that's in the 3D platformer, Zippy. No. Mario wall kicks. Um, and technically 3D World has the cat suit, but he can't, he, he doesn't, like, you know. You know what I'm saying. I guess. Yeah, basically. Like, <laughs> like, you're just Mario, but you do all this gymnastic shit, like there's a jump where you have to, like, swing on several poles to get across a platform. <laughs> um, you know, Crimson Crater would like to know your location. What's Crimson Crater? The fucking hard challenge from Mario Odyssey. Mm. You know, swinging on poles. <gasps> what the fuck? I saw it. Uh, I saw the representation of. Oh. <laughs> no! 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 Oh, you mean this? Yeah. Why is it cursed? It just says. No, no, you know it's I'm cursed. Sorry. Luigi being I'm flat sorry, while driving his cart. I'm sorry, I don't make the rules. That's cursed. <laughs> well, Mario... F I, I don't understand how it's cursed. Mario, uh, Mario's back faces the camera often when he turns around. Can you wake up that toad or is it just dead? It's unconscious. Let me the fuck in. Oh, wait, no, you know what? I'm willing to bet this is the debris keeping the door jammed on the other side. The elevator to the VIP stateroom is the other way, he says. 
Is there something... Is the I can't tell if the glass is cracked or if there's something blocking the window. I think it's cracked. Uh, Daisy. Oh, wow. Where are you going, Big M? The elevator to the VIP stateroom is the other way. You don't say. I heard you the first ten times. This is gonna be the new get up on the Hydra's back, I swear to god. Get up on the Hydra's back! Get up on the Hydra's back! Baby. For those who don't know, that's a quote from one of the boss battles in Kingdom Hearts 2, where when you're trying to fight the Hydra in Olympus Colosseum, Phil repeated Phil Octetes repeatedly shouts to get up on the Hydra's back so you can attack it, and he doesn't stop until you actually do it. Get up on the Hydra's back! Oh, right. This is a deck where... Hey, Big M. How much do you know about us bob -ombs? Enough? The life of a, of a bob is pretty short, all things considered. That's why we try to make the most of the time we have. I guess you'd understand better than most, Big M. You're risking your life to battle those folded soldiers. Ugh, listen to me. Sorry for the big monologue. Let's keep searching. Me gets a bad feeling about this. The fuck? I need you to do me a favor and get What ball? What fuck me supposed to do? Hey, that debris is gone. Why is it gone? Why has everything been Yeah. Alright, I guess we can go check out that VIP stateroom now. Fucking Bobby. I'm pretty sure you have to. Okay, the power's back. Quick, into the elevator. By the way, do you see that- do you see that rightmost potted plant near the elevator? Yeah. Behind that is a Sniffet. And they ambush you if you get close to this glass display case. It scared the shit out of me the last time. I see a representation of Henticle Tentai outside the window. No, I don't You're regret grounded. saying it like that. You're grounded. <laughs> you can't ground me, you're a frog! You can't frog me, you're my wife! I'm not your wife, you're my wife! Oh hey honey, how was work? Pretty good, but I quit my job. You can't quit your job, you're fired! Ah! How the hell's... Man, Inner Agent 3 really did a number in here. Hehehe, <laughs> he, it's funny because squid. I think you mean Callie Splatoon. It's, yes, Cali Splatoon, obviously. There it is, Big M. That yellow box. Where are you going? Where are you going, Big M? That big yellow box is the other way. <laughs> it's like he just starts changing to that instead of elevator. Okay, heal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put in this lockbox to keep it safe. Oh, what was the code? Come on, brain, think, think. You have, you have a, uh, you have a brain. How are you doing that with no? Oh no. Oh dear. 
It's Spoonhead! It's not Spoonhead! It's not Spoonhead! Hey, give that back! We have to get that box back. That monster is probably on the shift bow. Let's chase after it. Oh boy. Something is attacking the ship. Bobby looking angry. Bobby looking like a bitch. No, I'm kidding. It's a joke. Bobbitch. Bobbitch, more like Bob Bam. There it is! There's the awful gooper blooper that roughed me up! Ugh, what a jerk! Let him have it, Big M! Olivia is counting on us! Ow! Oh wait, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it! I immediately get what I have to do! Bloop, bloop, blop, bam! Gotta take care of them tentacles. Ha! <laughs> Hit it just as it was pulling away. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> what you gonna do now? He's gonna do that. Oh look, they're like little yarn balls. Oh, he did not like that. Me! Why do I have a skill in throwing? What? April. Dude, God. did you see that? No. That was a <laughs> Dude, I have to show you that. That was inc that was incredible. Animal Krong. Watch this. Look closely. He hit you and you didn't take damage. That was incredible. Oh, I love you. Did you know that cat? Kid or noises? Kid or noises? Kid or noises? Dead. Dead, dead, yeah. dead, dead, diddly dead. Dead, 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 dead. Oh! Wow, he vored all those toads before. You're like, stop! <laughs> Wait, what? I said, uh, I said, wow, he must have vored all those toads before. <laughs> oh. I don't know if I even took any damage during that. I don't think I did. Babam got a super important Olivia saving item. Da 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 da! Now we'll be able to rescue Olivia. It's a box inside another box. Thank you, Mario. I'm the captain of the Princess Peach. Toot toot! It was dark and scary inside that beach, but at no point did I sob fully and uncontrollably. Any fibs stating otherwise are just that. Dirty mutinous fibs. Toot toot! This ship was full of passengers, but we helped them escape in lifeboats to preserve customer satisfaction. 
That's great! That means the rest of the crew and passengers are all safe somewhere. Phew! Speaking of, let's head back to Sweet Paper Valley and rescue Olivia. Come on, Big M. Not quite. Still got a... Still got some things to find here. <laughs> ah! Help! This black gunk blasted out through the window out of nowhere! I'll never be able to wash this off. Ah, uh, I hate the sea. Oh! You're the one who was fucking blocking the door. Hey, hey, boy. Yeah? Olivia, King Ollie's like, first, I am no longer your sister. Well, congratulations to him for coming out of France. <laughs> right? <laughs> it's the Princess Peach. That really takes me back. Uh, I had so much fun on this ship. Bright sunshine, salty sea breeze, a horizon that seemed to stretch on forever. And my best buds. <clears throat> Sorry, Big M. This isn't the time to get caught up in the past. Olivia needs us. Let's go. Oh, there you are. Yeah, I did it. Sure. Ooh, stairs are very bumpy. Well, here we are. Sweet Paper Valley. Don't worry, Livia. We're gonna get you out of there. Big M. Thanks for believing me, and taking me to the Great Sea. Sorry I was so hush-hush about what happened on that boat, and about the item in that in the item in that in that lockbox. I'll tell you everything. A while back, I was traveling aboard the Princess Peach with my buds, my bob rads, my friends. We had all pitched in to share the VIP stateroom. Sure, some of us had to sleep on the sleep on the floor, but the open sea, the salty breeze, it was the best trip ever. But then, that monstrous blooper attacked the ship. We did our best to defend the peach, but it was too strong. That's when it happened. My fuse got knocked loose. It flew right off the boat, and so did I. Next thing I know, I'm in the Great Sea. Not sure what happened next, but I washed up at Toad Town. No fuse, no memories, no clue. So off I went, lost and alone on a journey to try and remember, well, anything. That's where you and Olivia came in. And then, those fireworks that we saw together at Shogun Studios. They made me remember. The fight with the blooper, my fuse, my buds. Boom! Everything came back to me. I'm so glad my memories are back. I remember everything now. Including a way to rescue Olivia. 
I think some of you know where this is going. And I, I wanted to try and really get invested in Babam because, you know, um, this is kind of, kind of, uh, ugh, kind of emotional, but I, I have neutral emotions and it's kind of hard for me to do it, but I can definitely say I feel a bit of sadness. See, sneeze. See, I had a lot of buds, but I lost my bestest best bud a, a long time ago. He got scrapped in an accident. His name was also bob -omb. <laughs> Olivia would have had such a hard time telling us apart. I always kept his fuse with me to remember him by until the amnesia hit. So it, I just it just sat where I left it, in that VIP stateroom on the ship. Wait, so that wasn't your fuse, that was your best friend's fuse. That part I did not remember. <gasps> Big M. If I can save a friend like this, it means I've finally become the sort of bob -omb I've always wanted to be. This is what every bob -omb hopes for. A chance to change something for the better. To make an impact. B Big M, I... I had so much fun traveling with you and Olivia. It's been... a blast. <laughs> Sorry, I'm kinda nervous. Thanks for the fuse, best bud. And thank you, Mario. For everything. Ba bomb Bobby <laughs>